The vice president-elect, Kachim Shatima, has warned members-elect on the need to shun Rakhine's National Assembly in a tent National Assembly to avoid straining the relationship between the legislature and the executive. Shatima gave the charge during a meeting with the speakership with the speakership candidate, Honorable Tadujin Abbas, and his deputy Benjamin Kalu, endorsed by the party in Abuja. Addressing the lawmakers numbering over 100, Shatima reminded the lawmakers elect that former President Goodluck Jonathan lost the 2015 election as a result of rancor in the National Assembly following the emergence of Aminu Tambuwal as Speaker of the House against his party's wish. We decided to show that unifying the nation will inspire national loyalty from all corners of the nation. And you remember Southeast, and you said, granted, that before now, no Southeasterner was in the presiding officer's position in the last four years. But this time, irrespective of the number of votes that came from Southeast, the party considered cohesion. And give us this. We are grateful. Given the current circumstances we found ourselves in, the stability of the nation is much more important than all other considerations. The most incompetent, the most corrupt Southern Christian is better than the most puritanical and competent Northern Muslim to be the President of the Senate of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. All other considerations have to be relegated to the background. Because we are talking of the stability of the nation. I met with Right Honorable Wase, the Deputy Speaker. He's someone who is pretty close to me. We'll continue the engagement so that we shall have a rank of free tense Assembly. We are very grateful to you, to Mr. President elect, and to the party for finding us worthy of this enormous of leadership. And I want to assure you that we will not disappoint the party, we will not disappoint you, we will discharge our responsibilities with our most education. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.